Good morning. Good morning, everyone in this room, and welcome to the Purina Institute Companion Animal Nutrition Summit 2024. I also really very pleased to welcome all virtual audience who is sitting in front of their computers or cell phones or tablets around the world. And just now, nine minutes back, I received information that we have 4,418 participants at this workshop. So welcome everyone to this fantastic event. And um, my name is Natalia Wagemans. I'm leading the Global Purina Institute. And uh, I take your time to give you a couple of reminders about the Purina Institute because I'm absolutely sure all of you you joined this event because you really appreciate what Purina Institute is doing for the education of veterinary healthcare professionals. And uh, at the Purina Institute, we really believe that science is more powerful when it's shared. And as a global professional organization, we really share science evidence nutrition from the Purina research, but also from the wider scientific community with veterinary healthcare professionals, members of veterinary healthcare professional teams to make it actionable that each of you can take this information and very easy implement in your research academic or clinical practice for the benefit of your patients. Because we absolutely sure that pets can have better, longer, and healthier life through nutrition. We interact with veterinary healthcare professionals in a different ways, and we share scientific information and provide education also in a very different approaches. And of course, we partner with the global key opinion leaders like yourself, like different scientific medical veterinary associations who is helping us together to shape pet-related nutrition agenda. We are sharing scientific breakthroughs that is very important to know because even those ones maybe have a very high level of academic background, but the practical outcome is very important to each patient in the world. So we're connecting the most innovative minds, and those minds, it's you, but also a Purina research, because that's where the brilliant minds are sitting, Purina and academy and the best clinical practices. And everything we do with the purpose to help you and to facilitate a nutrition conversation between uh, veterinary healthcare professionals and the pet owner, because together we have to collaborate for the benefit of pets. And today we are coming to a fantastic, to a fantastic program. This is a companion animal nutrition su uh, summit that Purina Institute is really investing in this legacy for the over 25 years. And um, in the few last years, Purina Institute, since it has been established, took a scientific lead on this Purina Institute Can Summit. And this year, we decided to talk about a very interesting and specific topic that combine making an intersection between immunity, inflammation, and nutrition. You will see during the scientific programs that will cover a different aspects of this that information we bring today and latest research we bring today not necessarily coming only from veterinary field, but you will see a lot of speakers who bring their expertise from the medical world, from the medicine, human medicine and human nutrition, because together we can learn from each other and bring those knowledge together for a benefit of one health, for benefit of pets, but for benefit of pet owners as well. There will be four sessions in this CAN Summit. The first session with Joseph Neuer will be about immune and nutrition, how, how nutrients can play a role in immunity. The second, this afternoon session, will talk about immunity and inflammation in nephrology. That is very, very actual topic for veterinarians. The third session will put the uh, kind of latest knowledge about 
what microbiome skin immunity and allergy can do together to build a tolerance and help to manage certain aspects of allergic disease. And the last one and not the least, tomorrow afternoon we will be talking about immunity and inflammation in the gut health. I have a great pleasure to introduce you four chairs who really put this program together. So the first one, and I may say maybe from the veterinary world you would not necessarily heard this name before because it's Dr. Joseph Nur. Dr. Joseph Nur got his medical training in University of Wisconsin, John Hopkins in pediatrics, Stanford University in neonatology, and University of Bern. A little bit different background what we used to have in veterinary world. So he's associate professor, University of Florida in medical school. And he was a director of the uh, neonatology fellowship training for many years. He's a chairman of the board, International Postgraduate Organization of Knowledge Transfer Research and Teaching Excellence Student that calls Hippocrates, a very famous and known program in the world of a pediatric neonatology. Welcome, Joseph, to this, to this session. The second chair of the session for today is Dr. Jessica Quimby. This name veterinarians know very well, and uh, Dr. Jessica Quimby is DVM of University of Wisconsin Madison. She got her residency and PhD in Colorado State University, and uh, she's a faculty in the same university uh, through 2017. Currently, she's associated professor of small animal internal medicine of the Ohio State University. She's a recipient of the uh, IRIS Award and other awards in Feline Foundation, and uh, she's currently serving as a board member of the IRIS Association. Jessica, thank you very much and welcome. Tomorrow's session, the morning session, will be led by Domenico Santoro. Domenico Santoro has a combined expertise in, uh, in veterinary medicine and dermatology, which is a very, very, probably a rare combination in the veterinary world. So he got his dermatology internship in the North Carolina State University, but his first DVM education he got in Italy, in Naples. Um, Dermatology degree and PhD on immunology he received from the University of Illinois and he is a diplomate of ACVD and, and ECVD and ACVM, which is a microbiology. He is associate professor of University of Florida College of Veterinary Medicine. Domenico, welcome. And the last but not the least, Dr. Mike Lapin. Do I need to introduce Dr. Mike Lapin? In veterinary world, who at least once met a diarrheal case in their practic practice, they know Dr. Mike Lapin because it's a big area of his expertise. But still, I take a minute to introduce him. So he's DVM from Oklahoma State University. His internship in internal medicine and residency and PhD he got from University of Georgia. He is a Kenneth Smith Professor in Small Animal Clinical Veterinary Medicine at Colorado State University, Director and Center of Companion Animal Studies, and the Chair of One Health Committee at the World Small Animal Veterinary Association, Wasawa. And with this, I welcome all four chairs, and now I take a minute to give you a little bit of logistic information because this is important. This is a Wi-Fi if you would be interesting to share a wonderful research you see with your colleagues through the, some uh, social media or emails. You got that? Okay. The next one, during the event, I would really appreciate if you don't take pictures because this event is broadcasted and the flash can a little bit, you know, reflect with the, with the um, broadcasting. All information will be available for you because presentations are recorded and will be available on the purinainstitute.com on demand so you can get all access to that. The next one is proceedings. For those, this information has been provided for you uh, for those who still miss that, you can take this QR code. For virtual audience, you can go into the platform and find this proceeding in the section of resources. 
So this is a quite, uh, short summary of, uh, of the presentations. And uh, the last and not the least, the questions. For those who are in the audience, you have a privilege to ask questions and it will be microphone provided to you. Please be patient, wait when they bring you a microphone. But for those one who would, would like to do that online, please go to this QR code or hashtag Purina Institute because it will be a platform called Slido where you can put your questions and then we will uh, combine the questions for the answers uh, uh, at the possible time. And with this, thank you very much and I call on stage Joseph New.